Alright, so we actually have three very interesting passives here. Pocket Sand would be an amazing way to start a blind pump, which I'm really interested in running since I haven't actually run one since the blind change. Enhanced Gunpowder is also absolutely amazing for damage comps and would absolutely like carry the start of my run. And Cookie is it's pretty crucial for like refresh comps and it's just one of the best healing passives by far. I think I want to try and force a refresh comp, so I do want to start off with Cookie. And getting two passives immediately is amazing. Well, this map's very simple at least. I just don't want to hit a refresh. There we go. Warp hammer, dense overflow. Dense means it's uh, heavier. Four, five. It's new. And it has overflow, so I, I want to take it here actually. I feel like that's a pretty sweet path if we can take it. That's unfortunate, we really don't need that. Wow, what is with the worst healing? Might be able to pivot into something which can use it as healing. Damn. I guess that wasn't too bad of a shot then. I think I will just shoot this. Boom. Perfect. And it had a uh, overflow anyway, so the damage wouldn't have the uh, excess damage wouldn't have mattered. One of the nice things about, although it is pretty ridiculous how much healing I have, one of the nice things is I basically should just end this fight on full health. Nice. Damn. <laughs> I was hoping it could do something funny there, but uh, not a surprise that it didn't. Not that it matters anyway, because I'm still at full health. Hmm. Maybe I was a bit mean about all this healing passive. It should actually be really good. Destroys shields in one hit. I think I really like this. That seems nice. And it's plus one plus two normal upgrade. Uh, two more healing, more refreshing. Wow, well, this round this run has an amazing setup so far. Oops. Oh, fuel. So I didn't mess up just yet. But I'm just going to preemptively clear this this shot. Because I really want to try and uh, text the full damage to enemy shields. Okay, that's cool. It's even has 6 9. This is a really nice orb. I like it. I think I'll do this shot. Nice. I'd rather take a fail there than uh, a right. I would have happily lost the health there anyway. But... Wow, it is really dense. <laughs> yeah, wow, well, I like that orb. It's kind of weird, but I just want to do this shot. Uh, just to make sure my path is secured. I want to hit that first. Goodbye. Guess we just go dagger. This is kind of annoying. This is annoying here. I might actually just um. I might do one reshot, just because uh, I'd really like to hit it. But if it fails the second time, then uh, I'm not gonna go against it. I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna be doing now. Getting those three bosses would have been absolutely amazing. I mean, it's. I don't think it's 
that bad of an idea. But my deck would probably be better if I didn't do it. It's pretty perfect. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I just don't know that shot. Which is unfortunate. Oh, it has cool animation. I swear I aimed at that crit. Doesn't really matter though. Winter Mantle is quite nice actually. Wow. Okay. Definitely not complaining about cheap clearing. There's so many refreshes. It even feels like there's a whole bunch of crits. Didn't actually. I wasn't planning on that hitting the uh, crit. I was just doing it to miss. Goodbye. I'm not really a bomb comp. Shackled Lantern sounds kind of amazing. I know it doesn't have. It's not pre nerf uh, Jackal Lantern, but. I really like Jackal Lantern still. And the more damage I get on it, the stronger and stronger it gets. Because it's, it's really just an amazing ult still, I think. It's definitely not as busted as it was before, though, obviously. Since uh, it turns out removing the one. Two upgrades from an orb makes it much worse. Who could have guessed? Hmm. Not bad. Let's try this shot or something. I mean, I should still be fine here. Would it be nice if I could hit a crit there, but it doesn't matter actually. Hmm, is this a place where I can actually take a salt orb? I don't think I want it. Plus zero, plus four. I think this sounds amazing. I don't mind having one less refresh. Yes, there's less healing for my cookie, but plus four damage on a crit is a massive bonus. I get still full damage with shields with this pick. I don't know why I bothered with it. Yeah. What would be nice is a good wall panel shot. Shield's gone. Oh. It's kind of annoying. Let's do this shot. And this should get. Yep. I think I will just take a refresh orb because at the minimum it's just a bunch of healing, which is good enough. And if I can get like refresh across, preferably, then that'll be amazing. Right. I'll just can't trash this. Hmm, nothing amazing. But I'm just gonna heal up that damage anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Nice. It's pretty much over. I'll just hit shoot this. Hopefully the crit gets set up in a nice spot now. Oh he's Six damage on a crit is still nice, and it is a multiple. Uh, even in the, if the damage was nerfed, it is still a multiplier. So 
climb heavy to shoot it. So let's try this. Oh, I can't get there, can I? Oh, so broken one hit, but I don't know. Did that actually do anything? <laughs> I want to try and pop these bombs. But it really doesn't want to pop. I'm, I'm not going to take much damage here, so I don't really care. The uh, full damage to uh, shields is quite nice. I'm going to stay on here so I can ping him down. Oh, nice. I forgot the Jack of Lantern goes through shields. I'm just going to shoot this. Sounds pretty amazing. It's kind of odd, but I think I will just take the new orb just because it is new. I mean, orb Zim was probably best there. It was definitely orb Zim or skip. Good first shot. I think I will just shoot this shot just because I have an easy crit. Yeah, basically puts me up to full health anyway. So you're not going to complain about it. That was a very, very bad trash. Go so hyperactive. Yeah, that was nice, but I don't think I need it. I think I will just take the heal here. An intentional ergo sounds good. Definitely don't need it, as I don't have any kind of self damage that will properly benefit off of it. So I will just accept the bribe and sneak away. Ambidextionary is amazing. I don't know if you get the cake from winning the it fight, and if you do, then kind of regret it, but nice. Nice. Yeah, like 300 damage. I think I will maybe upgrade that a bit then. Trying to head towards the crits. Seems I missed both though. Might as well pull here. Yeah, this boss only dealing three each hit is pretty funny. There's no need to take the alchemist cookbook there, so I won't bother. Bombs didn't need a one hit. Hmm. I mean, I don't think it's bad. Round guard. So now I heal, don't take damage, and can refresh quickly. So if I get like balance or something, then um, gravity hand as well. I mean, I'm not going to complain. I might use it once over the course of the run. Damn. This should be fun. I know all the refreshes are on the other side, but I want to hit a crit. Which I am kind of regretting now. But at least I got some damage. And enough damage. I need to hit six pegs first. Damn. I was hoping it could stay up. And I was hoping the ping would finish it off as well, actually. Well, this mage was dealt with. I think I 
we'll just trash this. Since there aren't many benefits from having two worlds. Uh, there aren't. I, I don't lose anything from reloading. Boom. I really need to focus on critting more. Goodbye. I mean, I didn't need to get the crit there, but sure. I mean, it still would have been fine. I think I'm just fine with a reaper. Wow. Overwhelmer there is amazing. I mean, I would have preferred some refresh or. Some refresh or might as well I think unless I get the boom because I get this one anyway I would have preferred some damage scaling just because um I mean this final boss does not care about overwhelmer but um I'm definitely not going to complain I mean, it's going to be useful in uh, this fight. It's going to be useful in a lot of phase three fights. This fight, I think. I think it is. Uh, refusing to hit these refreshes, which is pretty funny. Boom. Oh, it's uh, right. I forgot. I'm impressed with the wall panel so far, though. Seems very nice. I want to see what this is full upgraded. Hopefully, it's not just five seconds, because um, it'll be pretty dull. It's going to be a bit dull as well. I was really hoping for more damage there. Is this going to do it? And I even popped the shield. Silly mage, you think you're allowed to heal here? Oh wow, that's uh, part of what makes the uh, Jack of Lantern less desirable. I mean, I just gained benefits from that, so. It doesn't matter what health I go into this final fight with, so I'm not gonna bother trying to heal. Right now, I just need a damage boost, so I'm just going to take the plus one, plus three. Since there's not much point in uh, upgrading anything else and then uh, losing this fight. I have a scary shot, but I want to do this just to try and hit the refresh. I mean, it worked, but not the way I wanted. Might be enough. I don't know. It's still very scary. I need that crit. It's still scary. And I really have to keep up this damage. Alright, it's getting much nicer. Pretty 
pretty much perfect. That's exactly where I wanted the crit to go. I think we're looking fine here now. But I'm still pretty scared. This guy is uh he is not a forgiving boss. Really do need a crit though, unfortunately. Oh my god, really? God damn it. Nice. like I'm getting there but it's getting close. Ah uh, maybe not. If I hit this crit then it's over nice. I don't think I can really lose right now. Especially not with a critting jack jacket weapon. I don't know this jackal weapon is trying to prove me wrong. This is probably just the safest bet. Have I killed this shot? Nice, good, good, good. Yeah, that fight was a bit scary. There's no point in taking this. Haglon's satchel, I don't want it. I guess I will take an electro pigment, but I don't want it. I'm only really taking it because I want to try out having both of them. But I don't think I like either. Well, that was an impressive first hit. Now how I feel about it. I mean, it's funny. Mm, this could be an echo. I kind of have enough overflow that I don't think I need to focus on getting AoE. For sure, sure. Two dense orbs. Let's do this. Nice, this is going really well. So close. Nice, we got an upgrade. Although not that it actually does anything. Weaponized envy, I do actually... Sorry, wrong one. The thing is, I'm happy with cycling my deck and taking... Now I have two forms of ping, both of which are actually pretty good. Well, it was good in stage 2, I'm not sure about stage 3. Refresh shield. Now reloading is actually like pretty amazing for me. So we can we can loop back around. I'd rather not versus the slappy guy again. Make me versus the blind enemy, please. Thank you. Oh, we, this is gonna take a long time. And that one also. Oh, I forgot, it's the targeting of. Whoops. Oh, that was all a plan so that I can use this weaponized envy to heal and get some pinging damage. Like, 
his full strength for 5 seconds and gradually decreases over the next 10 seconds. 4 seconds, 10 seconds. Oh, so this is actually stronger than the uh, regular stuff. Okay. I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention to that damage. That seemed good. Nice, man, nice, good. I mean, safety net is absolutely busted. The question is, does guaranteeing a crit matter more? I think I want safety net just because I, I want more raw damage output. And adding more crits doesn't technically boost my damage output. It just boosts... Do I have... I have three pinging pa all three pinging passives, and then I don't have the special pinging passive. It's pretty amazing. That is... I... I don't... I don't think they needed to change it. I understand why they changed it if they changed it because they were adding more bombs. But I don't know about that. Now I'm kind of regretting taking the... Uh, safety net instead but it should be fine for this right. should, be, should be a bit quick oh right that's one of the bad things about the jacket right as well Forgot. it's like the targeting orbs are really good but they do have a inherent downside to them what why can't i see this refresh orb when i upgrade How will this refresh off go level 2? It's not popping up when I upgrade. I don't get anything from shooting it. Okay, so the magnet is strong enough that it can pull itself towards crits. It's just not something that I really felt like testing out, so I didn't. I shot that. All right. This might be a kill. Give me how many sappers I hit. Sorry. Rigged bombs. I think I overestimated the damage, apparently. Let's try this and just watch it go psycho. Feel free to hit that. <laughs> I must admit though, it is very fun watching um, it is very fun watching it defy gravity. That glove sounds amazing. Another passive? Or maybe not. I have um overwhelmer and I have whatever it's called. Grab your hand. Oh that was a uh, very easy. Um hope that hit the passive now. If you keep saying it, it must come true. Okay, so now I have all four pinging passes. Like that undoubtedly probably wasn't a good idea. Unless safety peg works with it, in which case it was probably an amazing idea. But I'm pretty sure I have every single pinging thing in the game. Oh, which stuff's fine. I don't know, this probably isn't going to end up well. Boom. Yeah, this has been a fun run so far. I don't need to take anything. Nope. Uh, this fight might be a bit scary. I should just have everything I need to beat it though. I also love this boss music. I forgot to say that last time. I think I should be fine. Kabbalah opening up with the damage is also nice. 
Nice, I was just about to say that I need to hit a refresh soon though. Wow, you can do that. It's very annoying. This. Oh, I, I was hoping that it would hit that refresh there. Oh, it's looking pretty nice. I don't get anything from refreshing, unfortunately. Dang. Please. That might be like a 10-20% chance to dodge. Oh no, it was a uh, meter damage, sorry. That's basically just finished this out. Okay. Jack of Land should 100% finish this. And now the fight's over. Right, that was a nice run. I have all the pinging passes, which is great. I do have a nice refresh and reload. Honestly, I kind of hit a lot of stuff. Although, obviously, the damage from consuming challenge is basically just what made this run. And Pigbag allowing me to take consuming challenge while still having enough refreshes.